give a brief statement, and we will not take any questions after the, uh, the briefing. It is with the great regret I stand before you today. I've been dreading this moment early on in this investigation. As investigators, we are trained to follow the leads, but never give up the hope that the evidence may take us in the wrong direction and the outcome will be different. We have recovered enough physical evidence to believe we have found Zara. Please understand that I cannot get into many specifics about the investigation, but the DNA evidence from, a, from the bone found on Christie Road matched a sample, a DNA sample from the house on 21st Avenue Northwest. The sample from the home was taken from personal items believed to be Zara. A known D DNA profile of Zara will be created from cheek swabs from her biological mother and father. The swabs will be sent to North Carolina State Bureau Investigation Lab to create that profile. Remains found at Dudley Shoals Road, Dudley Shoals Road in Caldwell County have been sent to the North Carolina Medical Examiner's Office and then to the State Bureau Investigation Lab for positive identification. According to medical examiner staff on site, when the remains were recovered, they are consistent with a child. Until that test is complete, we cannot officially confirm they are Zara's. The timetable for those results are not available at this time. This is still a developing case, and we are gathering all facts we feel exist. We understand the concern and interest in this case by the public, but we must be cautious in releasing further information so it will not jeopardize future court proceedings. The release of any informa information from this point on will be very limited. Investigators, agents, and officers and staff who have worked on this case are devastated that we're not able to find Zara alive and bring her home safely. We appreciate the support we received from the public. Today, our community mourns, our state mourns, our nation mourns, and the world mourns as we go forward.